QP Money Money Glock in my jeans, stretching out my pants on gold mode when the traffic light turn red Yeah, yeah, he say no scale, let's go red the limb She speak on my name, I'ma go fuck a friends, then pull out the limb Bitch, yeah, go steal your bears, why your nigga keep setting all these trends Yeah, yeah, this who I am Glock in my jeans, stretching out my pants on gold mode when the traffic light turn red Yeah, yeah, he say no scale, let's go red the limb She speak on my name, I'ma go fuck a friends, then pull out the limb Bitch, yeah, go steal your bears, why your nigga keep setting all these trends Yeah, yeah, you know who I am I'd like to officially welcome our newest recruit to the start of his WWE journey. You come into our sport think it's going to be easy, but you're in for a real wake-up call. If you ask me, I think he's going to do big things here. Look out. Superman punch! That shovel's an equalizer. Spear! Spear! This is going to be one for the ages. We are going to give you the foundation to succeed in WWE. What you do with it is up to you. So this is it. Day one of training at the WWE Performance Center. As you can see, it looks like everyone heard I was coming and decided they'd be better off staying home. This is cool, but there's no way my journey ends here. I'm going to WWE and then straight to the top, where I make sure hey, that- what are you doing? You're an hour and a half early for your orientation. I was just... checking out the facility? <laughs> There'll be plenty of time for that later. How did you even get in here? Guy up front let me in. Oh, big guy with the mustache? Kinda sweaty? Yep. Well, that's Todd's final strike. Hope he enjoys early retirement. Oh, no need to get anyone in trouble. He, uh, definitely checked my ID and even did a pat-down. Really thorough. So Todd's all right in my book. I feel very safe in his big, sweaty hands. Fine, whatever. Anyway, you're going to need to fill out your information on this and sign a bunch of waivers before you can begin training today. And when you're done with all that, there's actually a fun part. You get to design your wrestling gear in case you become a WWE superstar. You mean, when I become a WWE superstar? Yeah, sure. Wait, have you been filming this entire time? Is that a problem? Filming's not allowed in here without prior consent, which you should have been told by security. Frickin' Todd. Turn it off, please. You done with all that yet? Just finished. It takes time to design a look like that. Hmm, eh, I've seen worse. So now what? Should I go wait at the front desk with you until it's time to start? Front desk? What do you think I do here? I'm Corey Klein, head recruiter and occasional babysitter of people who don't follow instructions and show up way earlier than they're supposed to. Oh, that Corey. I guess when we were emailing, I just saw your name and assumed that... You know what? It's nice to meet you in person, finally. Go get changed. Then head over to the gym. The other trainees who started last week should be showing up soon. And to clear up any potential confusion on your end, they are men. Got it. Thanks. Hey, new guy, right? I'm Hector Flores. Welcome to the PC. Thanks. I'm excited to get going. Especially since I heard you started last week. It started here, at least. 
I've been training in wrestling for years before this. It's part of growing up in Mexico. Are you from one of those famous wrestling families? No, where I'm from, you were either into wrestling or football. Sorry, soccer. I chose wrestling. I chose football. American, to be clear. I had no interest in all that running they do in soccer. Plus, I love the physicality of football. I can see how that relates to wrestling, but how'd you end up here? I love playing football, but I just kind of got burnt out going from college to the pros and wanted a new challenge. I started training for this a few months back and WWE took notice. That's good, but don't expect this to be easy. You're going to have to work as hard or harder than you ever have before to make it to WWE. I realize that, and I respect everything that WWE superstars do, inside and outside the ring. But there have been a lot of guys who crossed over successfully from football to wrestling, and I plan on being the next one to do it. I like your determination. Now let's see if you have what it takes to get the ball in the end zone. Hey, who are you? First day training here. It's nice to meet you in person. Since I transitioned from football to wrestling, I've been watching a lot of your matches from Japan. And when I heard you were here, I was pumped to get in the ring with you. Yeah, well, you better act fast since I don't plan on being here too long. Why is that? Because they should have never sent me here to begin with. I don't belong in the same place as someone just crossing over from football or some stupid former mascot. If you haven't met that goon yet, don't bother. Don't underestimate me just because I come from another sport. Besides, I wouldn't be the first wrestler to transition from football. Yeah, well, I kind of wish you were the last. You talk a good game, but when this is over, you'll be running back to whatever team you were cut from. I've never run away from a challenge, and that's not going to change now. I look forward to proving you wrong. I heard you were starting today. Big fan. Thanks. You're a football fan? <laughs> no, not really. I just like your team's colors. Big purple fan. That'll be the color of my gear when I get to WWE. But anyway, I actually have an athletic background too. I spent some time in minor league baseball. Really? Who'd you play for? Well, I, I wasn't a player. I was actually a mascot named Ribby. But I was around a ton of good athletes. Oh, okay. Well, that counts for something, I guess. The best part of the job was they used to have indie wrestling shows at the stadium all the time, where I got to rub elbows with legends like Jerry the King Lawler. He found out I was training on the side as a wrestler and actually helped me get a shot here. Not that I couldn't have made it on my own. Even if Lawler helped get your foot in the door, you wouldn't be here if you weren't talented. I'll see you out there in a bit. Ah, oh, sounds good, buddy. Oh, and before I forget, can you sign your football card for me before you leave today? Sure. Just as long as you don't sell it online. Ah, oh, well, then you know what? I can get it some other time. I'm just messing with you. If you can make a few bucks, then good for you. And literally, it might only be a few bucks. See you out there, Chase.
I'd like to officially welcome our newest recruit to the start of his WWE journey. The rest of you have heard this speech already, so we'll try to make it quick. On our first day, he did the whole ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages thing. It was awesome. We'll do the talking, Chase. I was just telling him about your cool DX intro you did. Chase! What Road Dog was getting at is we are going to give you the foundation to succeed in WWE. What you do with it is up to you. Keep in mind, you will be judged at all times. The big man in the sky is always watching. Not that big man. There's a camera up there with a live feed that goes directly to Triple H's office in Stamford. The coaches and PC staff certainly have input, but ultimately, he'll decide when the time's right to bring the GMs from NXT, Raw, and SmackDown here so you can showcase your talents. I'm ready for that now. Yeah, we know you think that, but it's not your call, big shot. Okay, now that all that's out of the way, we're gonna start with some one-on-one -on -one matches to see where everyone's at. All right, new guy, since it's your first day, we'll let you choose who you want to face. Okay, let's get started. Yo, 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 what's up, y'all? It's your boy, DJ23. And man, uh, we playing WWE 2K22. And I'm a huge wrestling fan. I don't give a damn what y'all say. Man, I love this game. I was playing it so far, and they, it's, it's, it's a good game. It is great to play this game. I had gotten this yesterday, and it is my first. And now, I am playing the career of me. So, yeah. Uh, this is pretty much on normal. Um... I might play for the whole thing, hey, I might not, but yeah, but don't judge me, hey, if I lose, I lose, you can always come back to win, but yeah, let's get right into this. Okay. Get your ass whooped, nigga. Get up, boy. Get up. Ooh. Going back for the same move. Okay. Come on, get up, man. Oh. What type of glitch was that? Oh, Lord. Oh, shit. Top back, nigga. Come on, man, get up. Get up, man. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> Come on, get up, man. Get up, man. No, no. 
Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> okay. He reversed that shit. Ah oh, man. No, no, no. Nope. Ah, I didn't catch that. Oh, he stunned me. Oh shit. I'm gonna get a Whew. Oh man. Oh, you got me kidding me. No. I revert. Wow. Okay. Come on. Press that. Yes. Ain't that some bullshit? Ain't that some bullshit? Batista, going for the Batista bomb on this man. Oh wow, I didn't think I did. Get up, man. Oh, oh. Ooh. Yeah, I did. Come on. Get up. Get up. guys say hey nice win but keep in mind there was only one match mm -hmm. it's going to take a lot more than that to get Triple H in the GM's attention you think Triple H was watching you think Triple H was watching who knows he's a busy guy but I wouldn't worry about that focus on what you can control here and now that I know what you're capable of, I'll be focused on beating you next time we face each other. I look forward to the challenge. Mm-hmm. Hey, big news. We got another member of DX coming to help out for a bit at the PC. Porn swoggle? <laughs> uh, no. One of the members of the best version of DX, <laughs> X-Pac. You know, I have to agree that the DX you were a part of was the best one. Damn straight it was. But you know who disagrees? Shawn Michaels. You guys took what they started and made it ten times better. Mm -hmm. That's what I always say. Anyway, what if when X-Pac is here, we had a match to settle this debate? You, me, and X-Pac against Sean, Hector, and Chase. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
Okay. That sounds awesome. And if we win, I get to be an honorary member of DX? Let's not go crazy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Challenge accepted. Yeah, I'm taking it. Battle of DX. Okay. This game tripping now. More control tripping like hell. Oh, bitch. I do something. No, nigga, not this time. Oh, shit. How did I forget that shit again? He about to die from on the. Oh. They be doing that shit. But let me do my thing. Oh shit. That's a glitch. That was a goddamn glitch. That was a glitch. Whatever.
Uh-uh, nigga. What? Ah, come on. Oh, shit. Damn, can I just hit my move? Shit tripping. Ah, you motherfuckers, man. University, yep.
Man, get up. I don't even need to be getting tags. I don't give a damn, I don't give a damn. It's tripping. So yeah, that's it. If y'all want me to do more, hit that like button. This shit, my remote control is tripping. Alright, peace, y'all. Stretching on my pants on gold mode when the traffic lights turn red. Yeah, yeah, he say no scale. Let's go around the limb. She speak on my name. I'ma go fuck her friends and pull out the limb. Bitch, yeah, go steal your best. Why your nigga keep setting all these trends? Yeah.